minister likes to talk about being accountable and transparent, but every chance he gets, he uses his power to run away from accountability in this place. Whether he's stripping the powers of the PBO or changing the, order, the rules arbitrarily so that he only has to be here one day a week, he treats Parliament like it's a nuisance. So my question is, when he is here answering one day a week, will he at least answer our questions and not give us this rinse and repeat, repeat, repeat times 19 that we've had to deal with last week? Honourable Government Health Leader. Mr. Speaker, I appreciate the opportunity to rise in this house and to actually recognize that the member does hear some of the stuff that we say, that she recognizes that we can modernize this place and have some of those important questions, uh, some conversations that we've been encouraging. When it comes to the PBO, the Parliamentary Budget Officer, the constructive feedback that was shared was heard. And that's the importance of legislation actually making it to committee. When committee can do the important work, hear from experts, and actually listen to stakeholders, we can improve legislation so that we are serving in the best interest of Canadians. And that's exactly what we've done. Perfect. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. The Honourable Opposition House. Mr. Speaker, no one believes that the Prime Minister is being accountable. Even the media isn't buying it. The Globe and Mail wrote, we have the Liberals whose new rules threaten to make a government less accountable, not more. Mr. Speaker, only this Prime Minister would believe that showing up one day a week to work makes someone more accountable. Is the Prime Minister's lack of accountability genetic, or is it something that maybe he's learned from Kathleen Wynne? This government is committed to working hard on behalf of all Canadians. We are committed to having constructive and meaningful conversations to ensure that we are serving in their best interest. When it comes to a Prime Minister's question period, the member has been mistaken once again. The Prime Minister's question period would be in addition to the other days that he was present. You already see that this government is doing government very differently. We are a more open and transparent government just like we committed. When questions are posed of this government, ministers that are present always answer, otherwise parliamentary secretaries do. We will continue to respond to the very real challenges that they are facing. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Order.